Feud. It's feud time. Feud. 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 Chair. Feud. Still a chair. Is it warm? I mean, I guess. Feud. 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 Food. All right. Anybody who wants to play Family Feud, this is the final game show of the year. We are getting dangerously close. Uh, I've already, I keep forgetting. Uh, <laughs> I, I saw the feet move. I was like, um, oh my god. Uh, wasn't worth spending so much time in there, Dave. Uh, How long have you been in there? I feel bad. I took a long time. Since you left. Since you left. We expected you to be away from the remained silent and did not move. <laughs> Yeah. Sorry you had to be in my shoes for so long. That's alright. That's alright. Certified VTuber. Awesome. <laughs> that's awesome. awesome. Uh, Certified VTuber. That's, that's what chat was awesome. saying. No, no, take you steal from chat. That's yeah, where we that's... get ninety percent of our jokes from as streamers. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Bro, that was funny. Worth it. That was awesome. That was very good. That was very good. All right. Um, all right, friends. We are playing our final game of Family Feud. Uh, who's excited? Woo! Heck yeah. How many players do we have? We have eight, two teams. Yeah, four. we got two teams of four today. All right. Do I need to read the rules? We, we, need, we need to get names. Yeah. I don't think you need to read the rules. Okay. Thank God. Winners. Hey, Colin, you just always want to be the winners. Team. Team name. Well, I've lost everything. All right, so oh, this is team, team name. Let's try to switch it up. Yeah. Uh, Kata suggested winners. All right, we got team winners versus team, team name. Your clothing store? <laughs> <laughs> right. okay. I, I was going to say, discounted, look at you, yes. nonsense. <laughs> Last year's discounted, yes. <laughs> all right, uh, we all know how to play Family Feud. And my voice is starting to hurt. So we're not going to read the rules today. So we are going to go right into round one here. Uh, if I can get two contestants to the stage. Ashley. Oh. They're actually a call. They're already right next to each other. Yeah. Perfect. All right. Are you two ready to go? You ready to buzz in? Okay. Here we go. Yeah. Okay. Round one. We asked 100 chat members who submitted their survey at a time ending with a two. You're stranded in the desert. The sun is scorching. There's nothing in sight. What do you want the most? <clears throat> Ashley. Water. Show me water. Number two answer. All right, Colin, you have a chance here to steal by giving us the number one answer. A bus. <laughs> Show me a bus. <clears throat> no. All right. Team winners, would you like to play or pass? Good. All right, they're gonna play. Let's head over to team winners. Ashton, tow truck, tow truck. Show me tow truck for the bus. Mm, no, <laughs> they didn't right. want a bus. I thought maybe they had a bus and they needed a tow truck. You want shade? Boomer Ooh. says show oh, says shade. Show me shade. Yeah. yeah, number one answer. All right, Kate. You want a friend to come and rescue you. So put that friend rescuer. Show me friends. Mm. No. Also, I meant to hide chat. Bye. <laughs> All right. Back to Ashley. Um, airplane. <laughs> Strong answer. Mm -hmm. Airplane. Show me a plane. No. All right. Over to team, team name. The band? All right. Show me food. 
food. <laughs> no. All right. That is 47 points to team winners. Everyone's too hot to eat. Let's take a look at the rest of the answers here. Number five, AC. Number four, a teleporter. And number three, to just simply not be there. <laughs> what do you want the most to be? Else. <laughs> All right. Round two. Thanks, Chad. <laughs> if we can have two players to center stage or just raise uh, your hands. No, I think it's Ashton. Are you second? Oh, we can, we can go whoever. Okay. Okay. Whatever. Or Everybody's going to get to do Everyone gets to do this once. So. All right. Boomer and David. Oh, yeah. All right. Yeah. Zeta v. Zeta. Zeta. Let's go. <laughs> All chat members were asked to roll a d20. We asked 100 who rolled 8, 16, or 14. Go to your bathroom. What pattern do you see on your toilet paper? Us. David. Nothing. Show me nothing. <laughs> what? Oh, something floral? Turn? All right, something floral. Number one answer. All right. Team winners, would you like to play or pass? I don't know if I can come up with five other patterns for toilet paper. <laughs> right? So I would suggest passing. I, I think so. Yeah. 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 All right. Let's pass it over to team team name. Um, Trish. Diamonds. Show me diamonds. Number oh. two answer. Good answer. Good answer. All right. Uh, I'm next inside. Of yeah, Matt. Uh, fruit. Show me fruit. Mm. All right, Colin. Stripes. Stripes. Mm. Mm. All right. What else is there? Trish, back to you. Um, wait, isn't it no, David? It's David? Or it's David, yeah. Uh, circles. So show me circles. Dots. Uh, yep. All right. Yep, yep. All right. All right. Diamond spots. Trish. Um, I said diamonds. Triangles? Show me triangles. Mm. Oh. oh, all right. Over to team winners. Rainbows, clovers. Waves. <laughs> what? Waves. Like waves. Waves? Or, yeah. or oh. wilted. Yeah. I think that might fall under diamonds in some people's answer, though. Or dots. Yeah. Yeah. I think I think waves. I like waves. I like Let's waves. go with waves. Show me waves. Hey. Oh. All right. 62 points over to team winners. Let's take a look at that number six answer. Bears. No, no. I, nobody. I, oh, no, no, that's right. No, Charmin bears. That, yeah, but they're not on the toilet they're, paper. They're probably still in the packaging. <laughs> you might want to take those out before you use them. <laughs> All right, and number five. You also said that oh, quilted. Oh, okay. okay. All right, round three. We oh, need two oh, new folks to the center stage. Who's my? All right. I'm gonna try not to stand right on you. Huh? Kate v Trish. We asked 200 chat members who use the most ease across all their answer. If Dorothy from The Wizard of Oz was arrested near the end of the movie, what crime would she, could she be accused of? Kate. Murder. <laughs> sure, show me murder. Number one answer. All right, team winners, would you like to play or pass? Uh, Eight see. other crimes? <laughs> I can think of a few. All right. Okay. You want to play? Sure. Why not? All right. Uh, Ashley. <laughs> Give me crimes. Theft. theft. <laughs> yes. Show me theft. Very good. Very good. All right. Ashton. Ashton. Embezzlement. <laughs> Show me embezzlement. <clears throat> oh. All right. Boomer. Trespassing. Show me trespassing. Nice. Number two answer. Good job. Good job. All right. Back to Kate. A uh, dog and or kidnapping. Show me kidnapping. Mm. No. Really? But she took Toto. I guess that's maybe under theft. I what don't know. Her, it was her dog. Um, for that, you would want it to be something like... Um, the witch oh. took Toto. What do you get charged oh, this with is, if your this dog is charging Dorothy. someone? All right. Oh, yeah. I mean, Ashley? Uh, I don't know. I don't know well, enough crimes. You have to give me an answer. It's a 
Think of something. Just name a crime. Any crime. Being out of tune. <sighs> Too much dancing. <laughs> Too much dancing. <laughs> um... Name a dumb crime. <laughs> name a misdemeanor. Uh, yeah, name a misdemeanor. S- speeding. <laughs> there <you go. laughs> Show me speeding. <clears throat> no. All right. I want to see if jaywalking was one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. We're just like disorderly. She didn't follow all those yellow brick roads. <laughs> 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 All right, what do you got? Blackmail. Show me <laughs> blackmail. <laughs> no. All right, let's. So that's going to be 133 points over to team winners. But let's take a look at these other, these other <laughs> answers. Number eight. I'm sure these are going to be great. Fleeing the scene of a crime. <laughs> oh yeah. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Solid. Solid. Number seven. Tax evasion. <laughs> don't bl- I don't know. <laughs> yeah, never change, chat. Never change. Chat. Never change. <laughs> All right, number six. Use of an illicit <laughs> substance. The poppy fields. Yeah, the poppy fields. Yeah. Yep. All right. I was thinking about that. Uh, number five. Disturbing the peace. <laughs> yeah. 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 Okay. yeah. Definitely. And yeah. number three. Assault with a deadly weapon. <laughs> 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 Uh, <laughs> you're great, Chet. All right, we are moving on to round 3.5. Uh, all right, there's no graphics for this round. Uh, every participant we asked to flip a coin 10 times. Every morning, you've had giveaways for an amount that ended in either an even or odd digit. The single participant who matched the first two giveaways every day with their coin flips. Uh, tails, tails, heads, tails, heads, tails, heads, heads, tails. It, wait, what is going on? <laughs> Incredible. Wait, what? I'm so confused. Oh, God. Was Is Mail fr- from Pennsylvania born in 1988? He's right-handed, wakes up at 6.30 a.m., wears glasses, and likes to drink water. In this round, you have to guess his answers. Okay. For each question, <laughs> both teams may give answers. Each correct answer awards the team 10 points. All right, so we're just going to go back and forth. You get to answer first, then... Okay, so... No, you're great. Name a profession you have to be excessively strong to do well. Weightlifter. Oh, uh, just wrestling. Wrestler, yeah. Neither. It is... They answered mover. Uh, Next, besides actual food, name something you might eat or ingest if you weren't paying attention. Plastic. Plastic. Your hair. It's our turn. (laughs) <laughs> okay, they say plastic. You guys, yep. Paint water. Okay. What did you say? Paint water. <laughs> paint water? Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, if you've ever done a paint, paint night. The wrong yeah, yeah. Right. fair, fair. Uh, neither of you are correct. The answer is a bug. <laughs> All right. Yeah. All right, back to you. Or, yo, you'll go first this time. Name something wrong with a hotel room that would put you off from staying there. I made bugs. Bugs. Like... Bugs? Yeah. Like bugs. Some sort of bugs. Or maybe stain, a, a stain on the bed sheets. Mm. Stain bed sheets? Yeah. Mm-hmm. I mean, they have more bed bugs down in the States, right? Well, yeah, but yeah. the thing is, you, you also don't see the bed bugs if you spend a night in there. All right. Choose something. Like a dirty mattress? Or just dirty? Yeah. If it's dirty? Yeah, if it's dirty. If All right. Dirty. What was the question? Name something wrong with a hotel room that would put you off from staying there. Yeah. I said hair. But they said if it's dirty. What, so. what would what would this dude think would, would put him on? Oh, the dude. Yeah. Right. Oh. Yeah, we're trying to answer what this guy would answer. Okay. A stranger. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. A stranger, yeah. Already a stranger already in the room. We're sticking I'm to sorry. that. All right. The answer was dirty room. So yeah. 10 points. We're on the board. The team name. Uh, all right. You're going to answer this one again. Name something a student may give a teacher. late slip <laughs> I like that probably homework though yeah, probably homework. Like homework. all right you're going homework yeah, yeah. okay excuses <laughs> anxiety apple <laughs> an apple that's a classic yeah. well I went for the cl- yeah. Apple. yeah I'm down with apple yeah you're going with apple <laughs> let's do apple apple is correct <laughs> 10 points nice. team winners 
All right, team winners, you get to choose first for this one. If you ran a store located between Tucson and Vegas, what would you sell? Uh, what would you sell? Would be bus drive? Would be bus drivers or sell to what? Okay. What would you sell to? Would, would be, be bus yeah. There's a couple yeah. missing words there. What would you sell to? Would be bus drivers. Yes. We want to just say coffee. 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 Yeah, coffee. Coffee. I, I feel like <laughs> caffeine pills might yeah. be a niche. Caffeine pills is a little too... Well, but, I mean... It's I don't a know, source like, of caffeine. Long haul transit is where caffeine what, pills... Why don't we just say caffeine? Caffeine. 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 Yeah. caffeine. Uh, fuel. 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 Uh, yeah, you know what? I'm not going to give it to you. I'm feeling mean. It's caffeine pills. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> it's caffeine pills. <laughs> <laughs> what? You know, this random guy. You did lock in on this random yeah. guy. Yeah. I'll never doubt you again. I mean, though. <laughs> All right. Random guy, you? You, <laughs> you get to uh, answer first here. Uh, team uh, team name. Name something you can cook if you don't know how to cook. Craft dinner. Good. Although, it would be or, mac and cheese because it's yeah. American. Yeah. It's macaroni yeah, cheese. macaroni and cheese. All right. Mac and cheese. Cereal. Cereal. Cereal? cereal? You don't cook cereal. <laughs> but you can't cook. But you can cook But cereal. you can give anything as an answer. It's true. But they gave the answer mac and cheese. No. So. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That was round uh, 3.5. 20 no, points to team know. name. 10 okay. points to winners. All right. Let's head over. And we are heading into round four. This is our final round before the bonus round. So, Bastion and Matt. We asked 300 chat members who submitted their survey in a number order that matches a historical completed Gibagami. <laughs> what does a good theme park has to Plus, have? Roller coaster. Yeah. Show me a roller coaster. All right. Not number one. Seals. Seals, Matt. A mascot. Show me mascot. No. All right. Team winners, would you like to play or pass? Yeah. Do you want to play or pass? Hmm? Oh, I think we can get some theme park things. Do we have seven yeah. other answers? No, but do we want to play anyway? I can think of a few. Let's do it. All right. Okay. Boomer? They're going to play. Boomer? Good bathrooms. Show me bathrooms. Number one Yay! answer. Number one. Good answer. Good answer. Kate? Ah, uh, food court. Show me food. Number three answer. Good answer. Good answer. All right. Ashley? Walkable or easy to maneuver paths. All right. Show me well laid out. <clears throat> no. All right. Ashton? A theme. Oh. <laughs> oh <laughs> That's good. <laughs> Show me theme. <laughs> All right. Boomer? Water rides. Ooh, show me water rides. Mm. No. Okay. Oh. Well, I'm going to stick to what I was going to go with anyway, which is bumper cars. Show me bumper cars. Mm. No. Nope. Oh. First aid station? I was going to go with carousel or Paris. I was thinking first aid station. Gift shop. Gift shop. Yeah, gift shop. Gift shop. Gift shop. Show me gift shop. Yeah! Oh, yes! We got so, points. Do you, do, you, <laughs> do you see what is happening exactly here? Oh. You oh, have kidding. you have exactly oh tied. <laughs> yes. They okay. have actually tied. <laughs> that is unreal. We did not account for this eventuality. <laughs> no, I don't think that's ever happened. I honestly can't remember when that's ever happened. Okay, let's head back. Let's check the rest of these uh, these things here. Number eight. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Number six. Stab. <laughs> okay, people are resting. Sure. All right, and finally. And, and gate and entrance. <laughs> Very important. Sure. I noticed, I noticed that they say entrance, but they don't say exit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So 
Yeah, they're thinking yeah, roller coaster tie tycoon. Tie oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, that yeah, could have yeah, been yeah. the ninth <laughs> answer. That could have been the ninth uh, highest answer. How are we breaking the tie, James? So, uh, we're, we're not. You're going to play together in the bonus round. I need one contestant from each team to come and play bonus round. So, choose your uh, warriors. I've done it already, but I've I've also can. done it already. Yeah. Of this group, who's... A bonus round? I haven't done a bonus round. Do it. Yeah. Do it. Okay. All right. It. Boomer and Colin. Colin. All right. One of you leaves the leave the room, please. Um. Do you want to leave or? You both have to. <laughs> we both have to leave. No, 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 no. Just one leaves, <laughs> and no, then. I thought no. it was we're because we were doing both. It was two from each team. So, okay. so we're oh. working together now. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 Okay. It's all okay. tied up, man. Yeah. It's all tied up, so everyone wins. Yeah. Yes. Correct. Got it. Okay. All right. So. And I'd, yeah, somebody did point out in chat that me being a jerk and not giving you caffeine pill, caffeine over caffeine pills yes. yeah. caused that tie. Perfect. Yeah. Perfect. No notes. <laughs> All right. So here's what we're going to do. Two members of the winning team must collectively gather 200 points by answering six questions. The responses were chosen using the chat log from each day of the run as a seed. Uh -oh. What? Oh, no. One player leaves the room. Done. The remaining player gets 30 seconds to give one answer to each of the following questions. Points are then counted. The player who left the room returns and gets 45 seconds to give different answers to the same question. Same similar answers are buzzed out and a different answer must be given. If the team collectively got 200 points, they win. If not, they lose. There are no prizes. Are you ready, Boomer? Sure. I love the confidence. Name a cliche Halloween costume. Ghost. What would you bring to a flight in your carry-on that, that you wouldn't normally carry with you? A uh, neck pillow. Name something that you would that would make you think, yep, this is definitely a haunted house. Uh, the, uh, the, the, the creaking stairs when there's no one on them, like the, the noises. Phantom noises. I'm going to go that one. Name a situation in which it's okay to yell, don't go in there. When watching a horror movie. Name something in your house that you desperately need to clean. The kitchen floor. What would make you think an animal at the zoo was actually a person in disguise? If they took off their mask. All right. <laughs> God, so if they sweet. showed me they were a human wearing guys. <laughs> <laughs> Madonna, can I sit down now? You're, yeah, you can sit down. <laughs> That's a great answer. All right. Good answers. Good answers. Good, answer, good, answer. good answers. Good answers. Good answers. Good answers. <laughs> All right. Uh, engineering, you give me the thumbs up when you're ready to go. When Just we give do, it a second or yeah, 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 two. yep, no rush. Ghost works for all six answers. You definitely need to clean the ghosts in your house. If you have ghosts in your house, you should clean. You leave a lot of ecto slime around. Yeah, if you haven't cleaned your ghosts in a while, this is your reminder to maybe that's the ghost's unfinished of, business. I have a lot of decorative skulls, so they should probably get dusted. No, human or otherwise. <laughs> um, they're unfortunately pretty much entirely replica human skulls. My family has found that I like skulls, so they buy them for me, but they haven't figured out that I actually really love the incredibly bad and not anatomically correct Halloween things. Oh, like the <laughs> skeleton spider? Or the the uh, octopus made out of human spines. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes a necromancer just has too many spines left over. <laughs> All right. Looks like they are ready to go. Let's see how Boomer did. I said, name a cliche Halloween costume. You said ghost. That is the number one answer. 33 yeah. points. Yes. Question two. What would you bring to a flight in your carry-on that you wouldn't normally carry with you? You said pillow. Show me pillow. Yeah, that is the number three answer. 15 points. Question three. Name something that would make you think, yep, this is definitely a haunted house. You said noises. The house make noises. Show me that. Yeah, 13 ah, points. Good, good good answer. Question four. Name a situation in which it's which it's okay to yell, don't go in there. You said uh, horror movie. Show me horror movie. Oh, oh, really? I believed in you, that. You said watching horror movie. Oh. If you had said you're in a horror movie, you would have gotten some points. <laughs> you know what in the horror movies shouts? Whatever. <laughs> you didn't give me caffeine pills either, there. Don't. All right. And James. Name, uh, that's not me, that was that was engineering that did that one. <laughs> Name something in your house that you desperately need to clean. You said the kitchen floor. That's 10 points. Don't blame us. Oh, I'm blaming you. <laughs> if I can blame somebody other than myself, I'm blaming you. Question six. 
Uh, what would make you think an animal at the zoo was actually a person in disguise? You said uh, they take off their mask. Zero points. Uh, All right. Okay. You're at 71. We need 129 more points. I believe that we can do this. Let's get Colin in the room. Colin to the stage. Colin to the stage. All right, Colin, you ready? Colin, 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 you need to get 129 points. Oh. I believe in you, Colin. You got this. Are you ready to go? Sure. Name a cliche Halloween costume. A pumpkin. What would you bring to a flight in your carry-on that you wouldn't normally carry with you? Name something that you would think, yep, this is definitely a haunted house. Uh, the house is falling apart. Name a situation in which it's okay to yell, don't go in there. Um, uh, when the room's on fire. Yeah. <laughs> Name something in your house that you desperately need to clean. <laughs> My room. <laughs> And what would make you think an animal at the zoo was actually a person in disguise? Standing upright. <laughs> All right. <laughs> good. Nice. Yeah. Good, good, answers. Answers. good answers. Good answers. Good answers. All right. We will let engineering get those all set up. Uh, and while they do that, I will let everybody know that uh, we will be doing a giveaway. Uh, after three hours, we're going to do our first giveaway of the day. Um, we had, uh, we only had one giveaway outside of what will be the Ken Stacy Power Hour, uh, which is coming up in two hours. Ken will be joining us, and I believe there are three. I think there's two for our ships. Two or three prizes tied to Ken. So um, <laughs> we should maybe take those off. <laughs> yeah, we need to mm, that's true. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, that's coming up at 11. Um, but, yeah, between now and then, we're going to run this uh, giveaway in just a couple minutes here. We're going to fire it up. It is a magic-related giveaway. I know you all like magic, or at least, at least a lot of you do. So get yourselves and your wallets ready to go. All right. Engineering, are you ready? Here we go. Colin, I asked you to name a cliche Halloween costume. You said pumpkin. Three points. Uh, ghost was number one, as you can see there. Nurse, skeleton, cat, vampire, witch, and mummy round out the list. Question two. What would you bring to a flight in your carry-on that you wouldn't normally carry with you? You said toothbrush. That is the number one answer. Toiletries is the number one answer. Uh, clothes. Pillow, passport, battery pack charger, books, a computer or a video game console, and headphones. Question three. Name something that you that would make you think, yep, this is definitely a haunted house. You said falling apart. Chat says no. Dreaming. Number one answer, you see a ghost. <laughs> <laughs> Number two, there's blood or writing on the wall. The house makes a noise. There's a creepy decor. There's a sign that says so. <laughs> <laughs> the lights flicker, or there's a dead body. <laughs> Question four, I said, name a situation in which it's OK to yell, don't go in there. You said, uh, fire. That is the number two answer. Nice. 16 points. Nice. Number one answer, you just used the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> Number two, there's a fire. Number three, there's a gas or radiation leak. Number four is you're in a horror movie. Number five is confined space emergency. A sign that says you shouldn't and that somebody is already in there. All right, question number five. Name something in your house that you desperately need to clean. You said bedroom. Show me bedroom. Hey, so that was the number seven answer. It goes bathroom dishes, oven, the floor, myself, <laughs> my clothes, my room, 
and the microwave. In a room you desperately need to clean my dishes. <laughs> yeah. Just get 90 points. Credit. Yeah, just 90. Easy peasy. What would make you think an animal at the zoo is actually a person in disguise? You said standing up. Chet says no. Oh. Oh. Just okay, shoes. <laughs> nope. You want to keep trying? Uggs. They say move. They ask for cigarette. Yep. They talk is the number two answer. <laughs> they smoke and vape is the number three. <laughs> oh. They're on their phone. That's the giveaway. Yeah. They cough. They wear a trench coat. The number one answer, they have a zipper. <laughs> <laughs> Boom. All right. 110 <laughs> points. So everybody wins, but also everybody loses. Yeah, yeah. All right. Yeah. We all lose together, so we're the winners. <laughs> I don't think we've managed to get a tie like this in the years I remember. Somebody in chat's like, Wait, oh, yeah, I did put fame down for this. I think you monster. <laughs> I'm clearly not the only one, though. I've got the uh, the Dawn Guard credits here for the, the Dawn Guard game show credit meetings notes. Um, introduction, meeting to discuss Dawn Guard game show credits. Celebrate milestone achievement. Yay! Yay! <laughs> Acknowledging 10 years of dedicated service. Yay! Yay! Recognition of a long-term commitment. Yay! Yay! Special thanks to Jen for graphics production. Yay! Yay! Appreciation to Julie for her voice work contributions. Yay! Yay! Recognition to engineering team for the slideshow management. Yay! Yay! Thanks to Credits for their valuable feedback. Woo! Yeah. Gratitude to survey participants for their engagement with questions. Hooray! Yeah. It says attendance is mandatory. Note this cannot be an email. Yay! Yeah. And as always, Noi, thank you for uh, putting these together. Yeah. Always appreciate it. We'll be back next year for more Dawn Guard game shows.